Hi, good evening. This is your host, your guy himself, DLG Repping. Yes, I'm back again with another, or should I say I'm here again for another um, updated football content. So, um, I'm going to be talking briefly on um, what's happened today in the FA, where chairman of the Football Association, Greg Clark, has resigned due to the um, unacceptable language that he used to refer to black players. What a disappointing shame. You should know better. A man with his full education and high intelligence, you should know better before using wrong words. That is uh, disgusting. Well, on top of that, I'm going to bring you some Tuesday Gossip column as well from the BBC Interactive. But let's go into um, Greg Clark and read why he's resigned. You will find out right now to the ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls. So, Clark resigns as FA chairman, as it says in the head title, written in yellow writing. Football Association chairman Greg Clark has resigned over the over the unacceptable language used when referring to black players. Clark said he was deeply saddened for the offence he had caused by using the term coloured footballers. The comments came as he was talking about the racist abuse of players by trolls on social media to the DCMS Select Committee. Well, it's just... Um, well, it's not acceptable calling someone coloured. Because let's put it this way, Greg Clark or anyone who uses the word coloured, if I were to punch in your face... You'll be more coloured than me. A lie? A lie? That is um, something he's gonna have to sit down and re sit down at home and reevaluate what he has done. He shouldn't have said it, and um, he's now paying the price for it in guilt. Well. Moving on, um, Tuesday's gossip column. Um, Tottenham have been offered the chance to re-sign midfielder Christian Eriksen. That's the Danish international from Inter Milan, according to the Football Insider. Will Tottenham want him back? I mean, they've got. I mean, they've got a front world class front three that could push them to the title. Dare I say those words? It will kill me. If I ever witness it with my own naked eyes, I'll have to look, literally pull my eyes out. No, I can't. No, 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 I can't even bear it thinking about it. Oh, oh. And then you have Christian Eriksen on top. That's if, um, well, Tottenham wants to sign him. He wants to sign, you know. <laughs> well, we don't know where Tottenham stand on that. I mean, they've got Lascelles, so they've got Lemena. But are they going to be regular starters? I would suggest not too many times. So that's what's coming from the football, um, football insider from God knows where. Tottenham could also be offered an opportunity to sign Wells for Gareth Bell on a permanent basis for Real Madrid as little as 13.4 million. That would be a bargain, you know. It depends how he feels. I mean, well, I think he wants to leave Tottenham. I mean, Real Madrid, I wish it was Tottenham. He wants to get away from, from Zinedine Zidane a lot more. But time will tell. Sorry, that's from the Mondo Deportivo. Paris Saint-Germain and Brazil forward Neymar, 28, has told the club he wants to sign a new deal and is even helping the French Giants scout new players. Uh, that's according to Telefort via Daily Mail. Um, he wants to sign a new deal. And even, well, so he wants to sign a new deal, yeah? 
that's um, good news for Paris and Jamal. I mean, very good news when he says that he wants to scout new players. Well, he's a footballer. He's not a scout. He should concentrate on um, his career, his football career. Um, yeah, Bayern Munich and Austrian international defender David Alaba is open to a Premier, open to the move to a Premier League with Liverpool and Man City interested. According to the ninety minutes, I mean, well, to get this guy into the Premier League, it would be a sensational coup for either Liverpool or Manchester City, but more so for the Premier League. I mean, this is a world class athletic um, defender for me, and I do rate him very highly. And the one more bit of news, let's see what's going on here. Well, I'm going to read um, what's been said by Martinez of Aston Villa, because it says here, Aston Villa's Argentine goalkeeper Emiliano Martinez thinks the club can challenge for a European qualification. Well, I'll tell you what, they look a very good outfit. This term around, I mean, they've made key signs, like a loan signing of... Um, Barkley, and you add that with um, Ollie Watkins, and they've got a very well, they've got an outstanding football team. They gave Arsenal a football lesson from head to, from start to finish. They literally gave them a football lesson and outclassed them. And it kills me to say that we got outclassed by Aston Villa. Right, um, and I think that's all there is to it, really. Oh, I'll read one more. Um, English left back Aaron Cresswell wants West Ham to build on their newfound stability under David Moyes after Hammers boss said his team were no longer a flaky side. <laughs> well, it's, you know, you get a couple of wins and I suppose um, you feel that you're not that side where you become funny or flaky well only time will tell you know and it all comes under one word consistency we'll see if, it, if that is the case right i'm gonna um leave it as that that's the transfer that's the transfer um gossip column done for another day and um yeah, I'm going to wrap this up and say thank you to the ladies, to the gentlemen, to the boys, to the girls for listening. Thank you for watching and thank you for tuning in. I do appreciate um, your, I do appreciate you guys taking time out to watch a bit of my video. And um, I would want you to drop me a, a message or an opinion about my um, yeah, about my context on Greg Clark and um, some of the context I've shared with you from the Tuesday's Gossip Column. And while you're doing that, smash the thumbs up like button, please. And do remember to subscribe. Please do subscribe to my channel. Left, right, and yeah, should I say, subscribe to my channel, please, by smashing the subscription button left, right, and center. And speaking of some subscribe, um, I don't know who it was that subscribed to my channel today, but one thing I will say, a massive shout out to you. A uh, massive shout out. Yeah, a massive shout out to you for um, subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate that. That shows me love and appreciation. And that shows that you support what I'm doing. And um, the more of you that sh um, show that same... Um, yeah, the more of you that um, smash the subscribe button, the more that I can... Um, give you, the more I can give out the shout, oh, how do I say it, sorry, tongue twisted, the more of you that um, subscribe to my channel, the more that I can um, greet you with a shout out, that's all I can do, yeah, that's all you deserve from me, yeah, so big up yourself for subscribing for, your, for, or for subscribing to DLG Repping, you've been listening all along and you found me, yeah, big up yourself, Love, love and love and respect. Other than that, peace again, love again and bless again. Um, it's good night from me here in London, England. And um, it's good morning or good afternoon, wherever you are. But if it's evening, wherever you are, good night.
and um, do rest well. Latest. Nice.